Due to Ukraine already a nation on its knees this afternoon as the Russians take out wide swaths of the electrical grid in Kyiv and elsewhere, then came speculation that two missile strikes about 15 miles over the border into Poland were also Russian origin, leaving two dead. If true, that would be a significant escalation. But neither NATO nor the U.S. has publicly verified who was behind the missiles hitting Poland, whether there were Russian rocket parts that went haywire, whether it was an accidental strike, or whether the offensive was mistaken and undertaken by Ukraine. The timing, however, came as Russia was in a ferocious attack on Ukrainian energy installations, a dozen major targets nationwide, knocking out power at one point to at least 10 million people. Ukraine's President Vladimir Zelensky speaking to G20 leaders. We will not allow Russia to wait it out, build up its forces, and then start a new series of terror and global destabilization. We are aware of the press reports alleging that two Russian missiles have struck a location inside Poland near the Ukraine border. I can tell you that we don't have any information at this time to corroborate those reports uh, and are looking into this further. And so when we do have an update to provide, we'll be sure to do so. So this afternoon, even as the misery of a prolonged war has some in Ukraine on their knees, the ongoing danger of an expanded offensive into NATO territory has ratcheted up government and civilian fears. Even if the deadly explosions in Poland turn out to be accidental or some miscalculation and not at the hands of the Russian commanders, then there have been hours of wider war scenarios playing out and those will all have to be dialed back.